Alright, so I haven't altered my strategy at all with regards to the outdoor areas, so I'm going to be pretty much doing the exact same thing as last time. All the way right. All the way up. Still going up. So, it's not a Gigas, which means the best strategy is just to uh, leave a Sabin and Shadow in reserve. Interceptor? Stop doing that. I hate it when you do that, Interceptor, because it ends the battles really quickly and makes them boring. Darn, Shadow didn't die. I was hopeful that he would have. Still all the way up. Step up with one step right. Well, that was the hard part anyway. This time I have no idea where I am, unlike last time. Okay, this time it is a Gigas. So I, I definitely want to have a Shadow and Sabin. Oh wait, that that was definitely me using those items. Well, I timed his uh, Bashida well, apparently. That went very poorly. Uh, in those Gigas fights, I definitely want Shadow and Sabin to be a ta I mean, to sit there and defend because I there, there's no Gaudi Gax to throw out vantage counters and then start spamming step mines. So This building's pretty normal. Pretty straightforward, really. I don't have to do any tests in my menu here to figure out where I am because it's very easy to tell just by the noises that the game makes during this room a lot. Alright, I had to stop talking there because this. I. Uh, Zo Zozo has a tendency to have very quiet music that never obscures the door noises, so. Four. Okay then. Good work, me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Yay, step mine. I'm pretty sure step mine can only be used when they're not on. The oh no. I mean, yay, Edgar died. Yay, someone else is probably dead now. Oh yeah, that'll do lots of damage to those gabbledy gacks. Dang, it's over, because that went so well. Okay, whoever took the pointy stick definitely died. Three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. I'm sure that item will come in very handy. Actually, I know exactly what it is, <laughs> to be honest. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Wow, lots of encounters right now. That encounter rate being turned up is really hurting me now. Four, three, two, one. No need to get them out of the way, because they're definitely going to be more useful attacking. Yeah, that Bioblaster is really not helping at all. I should be using the Auto Crossbow, it's so bad. In fact, I should probably just be attacking barehanded, because that would be the best option, of course. So now I'm... oh, not here. Definitely not pressing the beat of the music here. That'd be silly. Uh. I'm not in an item menu somehow, apparently. Okay, apparently I really am not. What? Sabin used his blitz to maximum effect there. Oh good. That'll that'll help out my resources. I don't think I figured it out right at the end, right as it would be totally useless. No. Huh? 
Oh. That, that's not what happened. I definitely wasn't standing just in front of the pot. It's not like I know for a fact that they all took 100 damage there. So I'm pretty sure my item using was pretty wasteful there. You know what, Edgar and Shadow probably don't even need another one. There we go. So yeah, that, that wasn't confusing at all when I got out of that battle there. So I didn't make it out of that room just fine. I'm not opening my menu during those jumps to check where I am, because that would be a waste of time. Redundant checking never seems to help anything in this challenge. Now, there's definitely two staircases here. So this room, out of all the rooms in Zozo, this is quite possibly the hardest to remember. Probably is the toughest battles too, because it's indoors. Unlike in the LLG, where Clearly, the toughest battles, the most dangerous battles, were the outdoor ones. I probably needed to hold up for all that time. Well, that won't take care of anything. Uh. What is dead? Whatever, it's not dead now. It's undead now. It's been unkilled. Yeah, of course you needed it. <laughs> oh, you you needed two. That was a good sign for my planning earlier. I know Edgar definitely didn't eat a clank. Also, I don't see what you did there <laughs> with the ratchet and clank thing. I'm getting close to the bottom now. That's good. Unfortunately, Edgar's Bio Blast just kind of in the way. I mistimed it again. I mean, I, I got the timing perfect again. I hope I'm running myself out of dried meats very quickly here. Evans region probably didn't do that. Another bad sign. 
four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Oh no. Oh right. Th that's what I did. Let's see. I'll probably remember to cut this thinking part out, but... Okay, I don't know where I am anymore. Alright, I'm not doing the thing where I have to gauge where I'll end up if I'm in a couple separate places. Unfortunately, this door will give me a very clear indicator of where I am. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Rats. Okay. Not on track anymore. <laughs> this one here is uh, the only one in Zozo that isn't five steps long. Seems like it's set out just to be nice to me. Five, four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. And now for the appetizer. Eh, hang on. That makes a lot of sense to me. Which is a good thing just before probably the easiest fight yet. Yeah. I I don't like fighting either, that's why I don't play stupid games like Final Fantasy. I only I only play Harvest Moon, really. I especially don't play uh, awful, horrendous, badly designed mods like this one. Because that would be really, really sucky. You're not Sabin. You're not Shadow. Science last priority for the smoke bomb, because... Oh, yeah. The whole... I knew I was forgetting something. I mean, remembering something, whatever. Oh, well, that's gonna... waste time, I suppose. This isn't Shadow, this is Sabin. Those smoke bombs aren't very helpful. I'm just doing it for kicks. It should be a pretty huge deal that I messed up that first turn. Shockwave, that's always nice. Cuts straight through my, uh, thingy-majiggy. See how bad science damage is? It's kind of, it was kind of dumb of me to bring him, to be honest. The other uh, flunky died there, so that means that Edgar ha had 
waited until after uh, he had summoned them to select the targeting. This should be harder than in my test runs because I'm at a higher level now. definitely isn't the best use for... hang on. I keep thinking Savin's alive and want to kill him. Oh, here's the fun part. I can tell easily who got killed, and I don't have to use Process of Illumination. This time my targeting's bad, so I, I'm not going to be able to kill the Flunkies with the Bio Blaster. Where's Shadow? This is good, this is pretty good. Saturn's probably alive too. Cyan, slow down. Good thing I have plenty of Phoenix Downs, there's no chance at all of me running out. Oh, I. Uh, okay. Okay, I think I don't know what happened here. I I took one of Shadow's throws for. I I mean, I, yeah, I, I took one of Dataluma's throws for one of Savin's turns clearly, and not Shadow's. Yeah, I don't know how to make that into a lying statement. <laughs> Oops. That's badly timed. A recovery now would just be awful. As unexpected. Rats, so close, so close. I almost had it. Well, that was the easiest fight ever. I'm not interested at all to see what actually happened there. I'm sure everything went exactly as I was thinking at every moment in time. Especially that spot where I, uh... knew what Shadow and Seven were doing. Did Edgar <laughs> Did Wow, Edgar. You are sucky, aren't you? I was hoping for a battle there. I don't want to waste the shurikens here. You 
Interceptor. You're annoying. You're really annoying. Oh yeah, that can kill it, can't it? Edgar? Not on cue at all. <laughs> Alright, so that's just the beginning of my adventures in Zozo. Alright, uh, I'm not gonna equip... I'm not gonna de-equip everyone because that would waste time and wouldn't be safe at all. So I'm sure this will be fun for you guys. I really want to take a trip, an extra trip back to Narsh. So, it would be best if I made a mistake here. Unfortunately, this room is uh, laid out in a way that makes it really difficult to navigate. I'm sure this segment is going to be really, really short. Perhaps even shorter than my Mount Colt segment. Especially with this short cutscene tacked on top. That'll just make it even shorter. Because that's how cutscenes work. You can sort of subtract the length of the cutscene from the rest of the segment. But only if they're short. If they're long, you have to add it. it it's a confusing system, I know. Yay, more front story. Joke so good, I had to make it in both the LLG and this. Aw, goodbye, kitty. Yeah, I hate you, kitty. I hate you. <laughs> Lots to say here. Just gonna keep talking. If I mess up the equipping, I won't. I'll redo the entire segment. I won't I go back to Narsh and switch things up. Hopefully, that's what happened. Because I really want to make that extra trip back to Narsh. It would be very much fun. I'll definitely fight every battle on the way back, too, because I want all the extra EXP. Because I'm a little bit under leveled right now.
I'm probably something like level 6 at this point. Aw, oh, cutscene's ending. Emma implode. I hate it when the game gives me sound effects like that to tell me where I am in the cutscene. I find it kind of disconcerting. Alright, Esper's clearly the most boring part of this hack. Hello, Zozo. And now for less talking, because we needed less talking. <laughs> Alright, so this time I'm going to be very careful to press the B button twice, because I want to exit this venue out entirely and end up going with only two characters, that would be for the best. Alright, so it's Cyan it's Gao Sabin Edgar Cyan. Ones I'll be taking are not. The these two are the ones that I predicted to be the highest levels, which is why I'm taking them, because I want them to get even more over leveled. I had better get a battle on the way out. Alright, the cutscene's over by now. It's really unfortunate that this segment's ending. I could have kept at that lying gag forever. Or rather, I suppose, the telling the truth gag. I wasn't on a clip. That's it. Zozo. Wars. Left. Up. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two. Alright, I hope it was a shadow or Edgar that got set mined. Well, it obviously was Edgar, but... Two, one. Four, three, two, one. Yeah, I think I got myself lost. That wasn't going so well anyway. Oh yeah, I forgot where the exit to that building actually led, so I went completely the wrong way. 
that's the hardest part about this place. The transitions between the buildings are just kind of like hard to remember sometimes because it's so obvious a correlation between which entrance goes into which building, which exit goes to which outdoor area. So 